Oh my god. Welcome to Creative Bath Lab. Today, I'm showing you how to make bubble bath flowers. It's really hard to overstate just how excited I am to share this with you. The flowers are absolutely beautiful, they're fun to make, and make wonderful gifts. They dissolve in water, creating a lovely bubble bath. You're probably familiar with these, but this is how we're going to make the flowers. Different size petal sets nested in one another. To do that, you'll need wafer paper. Depending on the type of flower that you want, this is a thin sheet and a thick sheet and an example petal of each. You'll also need something to trace petals with, like a stencil. I'm using cookie cutters, in specific the peony. There's four sizes of petals. Each will be used to draw a different size petal set. To begin, draw a circle. Then draw petals all the way around the circle. Make sure as the petals get larger, so does the circle. And don't cut out thin pointed petal bases. Those are likely to rip. Make sure the petal bases are thick. And if two petals run together, simply cut them down the middle all the way to the base. Save time by stapling and cutting three to four sheets together. Use liquid bubble bath. Add some SLSA to boost bubble power. Paint the petals however you want. I chose peach with pink tips. Wait until it's dry before painting the back. While the petals are still wet, transfer them to a corresponding cup size. Lightly hit the petals with a heat gun. Once the petals can hold its shape, take it off to finish drying. Add single petals to flowers to make them fuller. For a more realistic look, curl edges and lightly heat them while the petals are still wet. You could also score in veins with a stylus.
Assemble the flowers by placing one size into the next. Use bubble bath coating to permanently affix the petals. Lightly brush some on the bottom and hold it in place. To finish the flower, spray Skin Safe Fragrance Oil on it. There was no way I was wasting an entire flower on myself, but the few petals I did use produced a good amount of bubbles. I was pleasantly surprised. Subscribe now for more creative bath inspiration. Check out the description for the recipe, helpful tips, and the supply list at the bottom.